afternoon to you one and all. This is Little Daffodil coming to you once again from Egypt Old Kingdom where we're continuing our exploration expansion and, well, our attempt to take over the entirety of, uh, of I think it's Lower Egypt. <laughs> Whatever we can get. All right, so we, we are trying to um, assimilate some new workers, some people who were homeless, and we took them in, but it also means we've reached our worker limit, which is an issue. So right now, I really, really, really want to explore out the right side of the map. I think we've completely explored what's available on the left side of the map, but I've only got one explorer dude. So I want to kind of take a look and see what everybody's doing for a second to see if there's more I can co-opt. And we are making plus 5.7 food every turn. So we have a good amount of food coming in. We're doing okay on production. I'd like to see our luxury goods go up. That's always an issue. But right now, if I'm not mistaken, aren't we trying to pay? Yes, we're going to patronize these peoples. These are the nut people. And I think we're patronizing. No, we're not doing anything with the papyrus people. We already patronized them, didn't we? I think we did. 100%. Uh, yes, they're paying tribute to us. And the Jackal people are paying tribute to us. Is this one of my guys? I think he is. All right, I don't know what he's doing. I'm gonna leave him to do it. Uh, and we'll see what comes up. That is a Jackal person. I just wanna take over everybody so I have enough room because right now I just don't have enough room for everybody to live. So I can't expand these anymore, but I did notice down here this. What if we clear out this sand? It will take four turns to clear it out, but right now the sand is taking 20% of our resources anyway. Now we've also got a guy over here who's clearing things. I think once he's done that, we'll have him turn into a explorer as well, since the goal right now is to clear all this side of the map. So, um, yeah, we can create some tools, or we can do a one-time boost. Let's see, three favor. I could stand to lose three favor. Um, but th and 30 production would be rough, though. But it would bump our luxury goods up one... Uh, and we're losing half a luxury good. It's always the maths that get me, you know? The maths in these games. <laughs> um, or we can boost our production losing 10 food. I'm not willing to lose food. Um, and then the favor, which I'm fine with. Okay, so for the moment, I'm not going to touch these, but I might do the create a masterpiece at some point. Uh, let's look at cults. Can we do anything with cults right now? Nope, we don't have enough anything to do with cults. So let's look at technologies. Now, technologies, I want to get up to chiefdom. I can't remember why. There was something in here. Oh, we can annex and assimilate. That's what it was. I want to get here. So to get there, I have to take proto-writing. So we're doing the proto-writing. Okay, now I don't think I can unlock anything else. Can I Can I even unlock the pig thing? I may as well. I never did. So we'll take the pig thing. And that puts us... Everything spent on that, and we're good to go. All right, so we just we need this guy to discover something for us. Anything. Okay, the nut people have made the decision. They agreed to pay tribute to us. So now we have more food, more production every turn. Okay, we'll take it. Um, all right, we're in the wet period, so we're going to increase our food and our favor every turn. We'll take it. We will take it. All right, that gives me two people because now I don't have someone sitting over here in the nut tribe. Uh hand-holding them because they're just paying us a tribute. So now I have another dude. Okay, let's take one and have him start up here. And let's go back down here with the other one. And let's have you check there. And then let's take a quick look at what this is. What does this like? Um, it is a fertile plain. You can grow anything there, but you can't build anything there because of the thickets. I wonder what happens if you clear the thickets off. Once they're cleared off, can I, uh, could I build houses? Because what I really need is houses. I really, really do. See, right now I could create a worker, but I don't have enough room for them all. 
I do not. I do not. Worker limit reached. Um, so, oh, ancestors are departing. Uh, I probably don't have enough priestly spots. Kind of a thing going on. But I don't have anywhere to put people. Okay, so we've cleared the fertile glade. Very nice. Thank you for the food boost. But we're going to not leave you there. If anything, we might have to do some kind of... And there we go. I, I want to build a temple or something. I want to increase what these areas do for us. These are the cemeteries, but I, sh I haven't been able to build a temple, and I don't know why. It would be nice. Yeah, see, pastures and cemeteries, but no temples. And I would think a temple would be a really good thing at this point. Whoa, bouncing around, bouncing around. All right, new territory. Oh, and of course, it's got hyena. Houses, barracks, and workshops. All right, that is what we need. That is truly what we need. All right, you're going to go here. And your first job is to get rid of the hyenas. Uh, 30% every turn. That's really not mm, a good chance of success. Mm. Alright, wait a minute. Am I telling him to do the right thing? Wait a minute. What am I doing here? Okay, yeah, it is attack all the hyenas. We're not going to worship them, and we're not going to make friends with them. We want the hyenas to go away because we're going to build houses there. Because we need houses! All right, now we got another guy, because he finished up up here, didn't he? I think it was this spot. Oh, another cursed place. I am I am over this cursed cursed thing, because you can't live anywhere. I need, I need a way to uncurse places. This is what I'm saying. All hyenas slaughtered. Um, okay, so we're getting a bonus in growth and a bonus in food. So how can we take the most advantage of that? That's a question, isn't it? Um, I think at some point I need to just go through and see that everybody is actually working the best thing that they can. Like this guy. He's getting 1.1 food, 0.5 production. Is there somewhere that's not cursed that can do better. Like, this guy's only making 0.3 food, but he's not mine. I can't move him, and I want to. Because they really could be doing better. These guys are only getting 0.5 along here. See, this is cursed. This is a deep bog, but it gets 0.9, which is better than the 0.3 they're getting up there. And there's this spot with a lot of fish. What was the guy I was just looking at? Uh, no, he's not one of mine. I don't want to move him. Point. Oh, he's not one of mine. I don't want to move him. Oh, they're just... The, the, the other people's peoples are not making as much food as my peoples. No wonder. No wonder they pay tribute. Alright, let's take a look here real quick and see what else we can get. We can get chiefdoms. <gasps> yes! We are chiefdom. Alright. Now we should be able to get some stuff here, too, because we've, we've picked up some cult points. Upkeep of Dooms down. Growth 10%. Let's just do this one, because I don't really have a specific thing I'm trying to do right now, so I like the look of that one. End of ruling dynasty first chiefs. Discovered chiefdoms. Chiefdoms arose as a result of war of conquests. Haha! <laughs> okay, many clans, protostates, whatever. Growth of five for every turn. We get to annex and assimilate. And that's a growth of five culture. Nice. I think that's good. I don't really know what I spend the culture on. Maybe it's down. Oh, this is what I'm spending the culture on. Technologies. Oh, I'll take it. <laughs> I'll take it. Okay, so I've discovered all these. I wish they were more distinguished so I could tell which one is discovered and not, other than that, having a big old lock on them, but, <laughs> you know. Alright, let's see. We have opened up some more. We're gonna uncover this side of the map. Alright, so you have cleaned that out. Now I want you to build houses. That's your job. And what do you got? Thickets, again. Okay, so at some point we'll go and try cleaning thickets out and seeing if we can get... 
some more buildable land because we really need to expand. All right. My goal is to clear this side of the map. All right. We've destroyed the fertile glades. Where did we do that? It must have been somewhere around here. I don't know. Uh, new territory. Is it this one? Blood pain. Okay, we can put more fields there. So we're coming up here. We're coming up here. Let's put you there. Um, Peak of Lower Nubia. Okay, that's history. That's the history stuff. That is one of the cool things about this game, even though I'm not indulging it in this playthrough. It's really cool that they, they really did try to include history. If you want to learn and play according to the history, you can. I, I like that about this game, even though I'm not using it in this playthrough. Um, okay, they want us to, all right, basically do a joint ritual. I'm okay with that. Um, we got Laffish offerings. They were pleased. Everybody's happy. Plus 18% relations. Okay. Can I take them over now? Where are they? Do they have like a central location? I don't think they do. I don't think they have a place that is they used to. Where did it go? Because I had to sit there in order to... Yeah, they had a place. Where did their city go? I had to have a place where I could put my guy to get to know them. Okay. I guess it disappeared. I'm going to have to actually go back and see my own uh, video and figure out what happened there. All right, so we have more houses. So now we have the ability to make more peoples. Um, so that's good. So we're going to make another peoples. But this peoples, I want to set him... I can't build tombs yet. That's right. Why can't I build a tomb? I want to build a tomb. Pasture and cemetery. Pasture and cemetery. Nope, don't want to do that. Let's see. I think it'd probably be a good idea. I can't I can't put you on something there. Oh yes I can. Okay, maybe that's what I did before. Can I assimilate? We did. We did that. No, we didn't. It was this that we did. We improved our relations. All right, let's try and assimilate them. I, I've, that's, okay. So that's going to negative our, it's going to negative our luxury goods. Our food and everything else is really good though. So I'm going to do the create a masterpiece. And that's going to boost our luxury goods. And that's going to help with the assimilation, I think. Oh, <gasps> okay. Oh, I'm excited. Do we think we can do this? I think we can do this. Now I have three people. What happened? Um, oh, we assimilated the jackal people. Nice. They are Egyptians just like us now. And there I was, had been making fun of their name all that time. All right. Oh, their food production went right up, didn't it? Okay, well, you go over here. Because what can we do here? How oh, there's, there's buildable space up here. Nice. We just got buildable space. Okay. So. Oh, now I have all these people. Okay. 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 I'm going to finish the exploration. I have enough people to literally just explore the last bits. Is there anywhere I'm missing? Um, anywhere. Anywhere I'm missing. I don't see anywhere I'm missing. Okay. So, we built houses here. What can we build up here? This has got sand. All right, let's go ahead and clear the sand out from there. Right now, we're in really good shape for everything but luxury goods. All right, let's see. Can we? What can we learn next? We can learn the plow. Um, what's Gary? Oh, temple! This one locked temples. Duh. Let's discover that. Okay. And that's all I can discover right now. Okay, that's fine. So now I can build a temple. I was so wanting to build a temple because I thought it would be a good idea. All right, let's let everybody do what they're doing. That should free me up somebody to build me a temple. Okay, we've uncovered all but this one piece of the map. 
The blooming has ended, and the blessing of Ptah has ended. All right, let's see where can we build uh, a temple. Here. Uh, wait a minute. What is that? That means it's cursed. We're not building there. Okay, so where we can build houses, we can build a temple. Don't really want to give up housing land for a temple if I can help it, but I don't think I'm going to have a choice. I don't think I am. You guys are doing fine. You're going to now be able to build a temple, but I would rather... Oops, sorry, wrong button. I would rather be able to build a temple up here near my original homeland. I want to know how to uncurse land. All right, so I can now build a temple. Cemeteries, workshops, barracks. We're going with temple because I just think that's a good idea. And now we are massively under production. So um, let's see. We are, yeah, we're massively under production. What do you mean? It, it, oh, pride of lions are eating my people. There's no pride in eating my people. A tutorial, regions and population. I don't know what those are. Map of Egypt. Uh, 1,000 times slower than that of city... M the, wait a minute. There's a bigger map? The map of Egypt has a scale. Using our navy, we can even visit other continents. Regions and populations. We can also... S okay, so wait a minute. Something just unlocked, and I don't know what it is. Uh... Okay, I still can't get anywhere like this. So what what just opened? I am confused. Oh! 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 oh, oh Looky down here in the menu. Oh, a new thing. A new thing. Oh, we get a new thing. Oh! Okay. We got a map of Egypt. Uh, unknown territory. Drag a worker. So this must be... Uh, where am I? Where where are we on this map? You know what I mean? Is this me on the map? Horus people. I'm, I'm assuming that must be me. Because why would I explore around there? Alright, I have a worker. I will put the worker here. No, here. There's only two turns to explore. Oh, that's that's weird. Okay, so now, if I go, oh, that means people are going to be able to come to where I am, aren't they? I might have, to, I might end up in a wars. I don't want to end up in wars, but I, that map is a little weird because I don't understand where I am relative to it. I don't, but you know, I get lost walking around in my backyard. Okay, we are going to lose a little more favor. We are definitely in a production pickle. We're in a production pickle. Hmm. Um, I want to get to the next turn. We are way good on food. I need to increase production. So have I got people who are doing no production that I can put? Like this guy, I moved him over here for increased food. But if I put him back here, I'll get a little less food but more production. What else have we got? You are only making a point one. Do I? Oh, I haven't assimilated you yet. Assimilation is key. Uh, why are you working on car? Oh, you're not my guy. I don't care. Um, okay, so that's where the lions are. That's where I was. No, am I not? I'm building the temple up there. That's the cursed place. We're not doing nothing there. I want to find a way to up my production stuff. This guy. Where can I put this guy? down here. Um, if I put him here. Okay, that helps a little bit. Um, it's not a happy place, though. We've got some aggressive antelopes, you know. Aggressive antelopes does not sound good. What's this? This says nothing can be built here. What about over here? What have we got over here? Thickets. We've got thickets. Thickets. Okay. 
You're making food, you're making food. Can I move you? No, I can't move you. You're not a jackal person. Who are you? You're a nut people. I haven't assimilated the nut people yet either. Okay. I think I gotta just leave him there for the moment. Let's end that turn. All right, so now we've opened up this spot. Ah, but wait a minute. Hungry hyenas. Examine. Oh, they're here. This area. Can the hyenas and the lions please fight themselves? They can have each other for lunch. <laughs> All right, let's take a quick look at the map of Egypt now. Because how, how do I get... How does this work? Can I start populating it? Our relations are 76% friendly, fertile land, sacred ground, this resource is being Eastern Delta Tribe. Okay, I guess I'll just put him there for now, we'll, we'll explore another one. But how do I get to know the people better? Now, they said something about being able to visit them by ship. I don't understand. Not gonna lie. So, I think this is a good place to end this episode. Um, and let me see if I can figure out what this map thing is and what it means and how I can travel. Because can I, you know send someone. I don't really have a, a, main, a main place. I don't have a wharf. I don't have ships. Um, so let me do a little research in the next episode. We'll see what we can figure out. Okay? Thank you, as always, folks, for joining me. This is Little Daffodil. I'll see you in the next one.